Last of the evens being placed. And a little bit reluctant to go in, son of Harker. Is in now. Green light goes on. Set to go. Aston Bullard, our drifting favourite, box two. Set to go. Away, Sweet Silence headed by Aston Bullard, who began well, but Sweet Silence kicks up on the inside and now takes the lead. But Aston Bullard's up there with it around the outside. Maxwell Hammer and Alinga Chloe's also handy as well. Maxwell Hammer goes very quickly and takes the lead from Aston Bullard, who's getting squeezed up on the inside. But Maxwell Hammer, too much toe, burns off Aston Bullard, who tries to come again. Son of Harker late, but too good. Maxwell Hammer, Aston Bullard second, Son of Harker third. Uprise got home for fourth. Sweet Silence was behind those. Uh, then in turn, we had uh, Go the Grove, Frodo Baggins and Alinga Chloe got awfully tired and finished at the tail end of the field. Well, they got something out of that one. Maxwell Hammer was well supported and was too strong for them. Loomed up around the bend. Seemed like Aston Bullard had his chance, the favourite. He had to conquer Sweet Silence, who kicked up underneath him in the early stages. But Maxwell Hammer was starting to build up momentum around the outside and quickly sped up to the favourite Aston Bullard around the bend. Wanted to cut down to the inside, they bumped, and Maxwell Hammer got the better of that, and then careered away from Aston Bullard, who plotted on second prize. Son of Harkins Bay ground to get in for third, and Uprise will be there for fourth. So it's 5-2-6-4, 22-47 the time. 5-2-6-4, the judges' numbers after race six on the program. 22-47 the run, and the well-supported Maxwell Hammer for Stephen Brook gets first prize. That was race six, two and a half by one and a quarter, 22.47 the gallop, standing by for the all clear after race six.